Hey guys, Tech Domain here with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to delete a subscribe calendar on your iPhone on the latest iOS version. So let's get started. Now, there's two places that you need to look when it comes to deleting a subscribe calendar. First place is going to be on your actual calendar app itself. You might notice in this interface, it's going to look something like this. If it's not, just go ahead and click on a date. doesn't matter what date it is. And then right at the bottom, you should see calendar. So we want to click on calendars here. Now, if you're using multiple calendars, maybe one for work, play, or just decide one that you have added or subscribed to, right? We need to go ahead and find the calendar you want to delete. In our case, I'm going to delete this squad calendar. So I click on that eye icon up here which will give me the option to delete this calendar. So if I click on delete, as you can see here, all events associated with that will be also deleted. So keep that in mind. If you delete a calendar, all the events on your calendar will be removed. So I click on delete and it's gone now. That's one way to delete it. Now, if you have a calendar that's being added from your uh, your email account, that's going to be slightly different here. So in order to delete one from your calendar we need to go into our setting over iphone from there on we need to go to right here where it says calendar and from there on you see accounts here so if i click on it i have two accounts that are uh, basically where i have subscribe calendar one which is my icloud and then this gmail one so i click on this one and now a couple of things you can do here first thing is you can just disable it which will kind of delete all the events by clicking on that toggle as you can see it will delete all the events from that a gmail account that's being put on my calendar so i can just delete that like that and if you want you can also delete the whole account but keep in mind if you do delete the whole account things like your email uh, other things like notes associated with that with that email will also be removed so just disabling it will be enough to delete the subscribe calendar off your iphone so that's how you do it on the latest version of the iphone i hope this video was helpful if so please consider a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iphone and other ios devices see you guys next time